Yo, we're headed to Jamaica. This island packs a punch. Culture, it's got layers, music, born here, natural beauty. Get ready to be wowed. Jamaica isn't just a place you visit, it gets under your skin, the rhythm, the flavors, the people, it stays with you. So what are you waiting for? Pack your bags, grab your appetite for adventure, and let's go. We're about to dive deep into what makes Jamaica so damn special. Get ready to feel alright, mun. This isn't just another beach trip. Yeah, the beaches are legendary. But Jamaica is more than a postcard. We're talking about the birthplace of reggae, the home of jerk chicken, a place where the history is as vibrant as the landscape. This is about experiencing a culture that's as warm as the Caribbean sun. It's about understanding the soul of a nation. Get ready for a journey. We're going beyond the resorts and into the heart of Jamaica. Jamaica's culture is a force of nature, it's a mix of everything, Africa, Europe, indigenous roots, all blended together over centuries, you feel it everywhere you go, in the music, obviously, but also in the food, the language, the way people move. This isn't a culture that's been diluted or Disney-fied, it's raw, it's real, and it's powerful. You see it in the way people interact with each other, the warmth, the humor, the way they embrace life, it's infectious. You can't help but get swept up in it. This is a place where tradition runs deep, but it's not stuck in the past, it's constantly evolving, finding new ways to express itself. You want to understand Jamaica? You got to understand its history. It's a story of resilience, of overcoming adversity, of holding on to your identity in the face of everything. From the indigenous Taino people to the arrival of the Spanish, then the British, slavery, emancipation, independence, it's all there in the DNA of this island. And how do they celebrate this history? With festivals, of course. Reggae Sumfest is the big one, a celebration of music, culture, and Jamaican pride. But there are smaller festivals happening all the time, each one with its own unique flavor. This is living history. It's not confined to museums or textbooks. It's happening right there on the streets, in the music, in the food. Let's talk about food, man. Jamaican cuisine is a flavor explosion. It's bold, it's spicy, it's full of life. Just like the island itself. We're talking jerk chicken, obviously. Marinated in a blend of spices that'll blow your mind. But don't sleep on the seafood. Escovitch fish, brown stew fish, fresh from the ocean, cooked with love. And then there's the national dish, ackee and salt fish. Sounds weird, tastes amazing. A unique blend of savory and sweet. Trust me on this one. Wash it all down with a cold red stripe beer or a glass of rum punch. And don't forget the Blue Mountain Coffee, some of the best in the world. Strong, aromatic, perfect way to start your day. Forget your mass-produced tourist traps. Jamaica is all about authentic experiences, and that extends to the souvenirs. Hit up the local markets, talk to the artisans, hear their stories. These are the people keeping Jamaican traditions alive. You'll find everything from wood carvings and paintings to hand-woven baskets and jewelry. Each piece is unique. Each one tells a story. This isn't just about buying trinkets. It's about supporting local communities. It's about taking a piece of Jamaica's heart home with you. Let's talk about the sound of Jamaica, reggae. It's more than just a genre, man. It's a movement, a way of life. Born on this island, it's taken over the world. Those infectious rhythms, those soulful melodies, those lyrics that hit you right in the gut. It gets under your skin. It makes you want to move, makes you want to think, makes you want to feel alive. Reggae is about struggle, yeah. But it's also about hope, about unity, about fighting for what you believe in. It's a soundtrack for revolution. And it all started here in the heart of Jamaica, from ska to rocksteady to dub. It's a constantly evolving sound reflecting the island's soul. You can't talk about reggae without talking about Bob Marley, the tough gong, the legend. He took this music to the world, made it a global phenomenon. But Marley was more than just a musician. He was a poet, a prophet, a revolutionary. 
his words spoke truth to power and they still resonate today. Visiting the Bob Marley Museum in Kingston is a pilgrimage, man. You walk through his life, his music, his message, you feel the power of the man. But reggae isn't just about one man, it's a tapestry of talent. Peter Tosh, Jimmy Cliff, Burning Spear, Toots and the Maytals, the list goes on and on. You want to experience the real Jamaica? Get off the resort and find a local dance hall session. This is where the heart of Jamaican music beats. It's raw, it's energetic, it's pure vibes. The music is loud, the bass is heavy, the bodies are moving. It's a celebration of life, of rhythm, of Jamaican culture. Don't be shy, man. Jump in and move your body. The steps are simple, the energy is contagious. You'll be sweating, you'll be smiling, you'll be feeling the rhythm deep in your soul. This isn't just dancing, it's a way of life. It's about letting go, connecting with the music, connecting with each other. In Jamaica, the whole island is a stage. You'll see it on street corners, in bars, on beaches, music is everywhere. It's in the air you breathe. From impromptu jam sessions to organized performances, you never know what you're gonna stumble upon, but you know it's gonna be good. And it's not just reggae. You'll hear ska, rocksteady, dancehall, soca, a fusion of sounds reflecting the island's diverse musical heritage. So keep your ears open, man. Keep your mind open and be ready to move your feet because in Jamaica, the music never stops. Yeah, Jamaica's got beaches, but we're not talking about your average tourist traps. This is raw, untamed beauty, the kind of landscapes that take your breath away. Forget those oversaturated Instagram shots. This is about experiencing it firsthand, feeling the sand between your toes, the sun on your skin, tasting the salt air on your lips. This ain't no staged photo shoot. This is mother nature at her finest, wild, unpredictable, absolutely stunning. We're going beyond the resorts, beyond the crowds. We're going deep into the heart of Jamaica's natural wonders. Negril, Seven Mile Beach. The name says it all. This ain't just another stretch of sand. This is paradise found. White sand so soft it's like walking on clouds. Water so clear you can see straight to the bottom. Palm trees swaying in the breeze, providing some much needed shade. Spend your days swimming, sunbathing, sipping on red stripe, or get active with some water sports. Snorkeling, diving, jet skiing, whatever floats your boat. As the sun sets, the beach transforms. Fire eaters and drummers create a magical atmosphere. Grab a drink from a beach bar and watch the sky explode in a riot of colors. This is the real Jamaica. Laid back, beautiful, unforgettable. Let's be real, the beaches are just the beginning. Venture inland and you'll discover a whole other side to Jamaica, the Blue Mountains, majestic peaks rising out of the lush rainforest. This is where they grow that world-famous coffee. But it's more than just a caffeine fix. Hike through the trails, breathe in the fresh mountain air, discover hidden waterfalls and secret swimming holes. This is nature at its most raw and powerful. And the views, let's just say you'll wanna bring your camera. Panoramic vistas that stretch for miles, clouds rolling over the mountaintops, it's enough to make you believe in magic. Section 4. Waterfalls and Wonders. Waterfalls, they're nature's way of showing off, and Jamaica's got some of the best in the business. Dunn's River Falls, a natural wonder. Tiered cascades of water tumbling down moss-covered rocks, you can climb them, you can swim in them, you can just stand there and be mesmerized by their beauty. But don't sleep on the lesser known falls, Reach Falls, YS Falls, each one unique, each one offering its own brand of natural splendor. Take a dip in the cool, refreshing water, feel the spray on your face, let the power of nature wash over you. This is what it's all about, man. Section 5 nature's therapy forget your fancy spas and meditation retreats in jamaica nature is the ultimate healer the sound of the waves crashing against the shore the feel of the sand between your toes the smell of the salt air it's enough to melt away all your stress and worries take a walk along the beach at sunset listen to the palm trees sway in the breeze watch the pelicans dive for fish 
This is therapy, man, pure and simple. Jamaica's natural beauty has a way of getting under your skin. It's a reminder that there's more to life than the hustle and bustle. It's a chance to reconnect with yourself and with the natural world. Section one, beyond the beach towel. Look, I get it. Sometimes you just wanna park your ass on a beautiful beach and do nothing, and that's cool. Jamaica's got you covered. But this island's got a pulse, man. It's calling you to explore, to push your limits, to get a little wild. So ditch the beach towel for a day. Trade that fruity cocktail for a shot of adrenaline. We're about to crank it up a notch. This ain't your grandma's vacation. Unless, of course, your grandma is a total badass. Then by all means, bring her along. Get ready to experience Jamaica's adventurous side. The side that gets your heart pumping and your adrenaline flowing. First up, let's tackle some whitewater. The Martha Bray River, a legendary stretch of water that winds its way through the heart of Jamaica. Hop aboard a bamboo raft. Yeah, you heard that right. Bamboo. It's a traditional way of navigating these waters, and it's surprisingly stable. Your guide will navigate the rapids, telling you stories about the river and the surrounding rainforest. You just sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. Or if you're feeling brave, grab a paddle and help out. The water's cool and refreshing. The scenery is breathtaking. It's an experience you won't soon forget. And hey, if you happen to fall in, it's all part of the fun, right? Ever dreamed of flying through the rainforest canopy? Jamaica's got you covered, zip lining. It's not for the faint of heart, but if you're up for the challenge, it's an experience you'll never forget. Strap yourself into a harness and get ready to soar. You'll zip from platform to platform high above the rainforest floor. The views are incredible. The wind whips through your hair. The adrenaline surges through your veins. You'll see Jamaica from a whole new perspective. Spot exotic birds and monkeys in their natural habitat. Feel the true meaning of freedom. It's a rush, man. It's exhilarating. It's a chance to unleash your inner Tarzan or Jane. Just don't look down. All right, adventure junkies, ready to take it up another notch? Get your gear ready because we're about to embark on an unforgettable journey. Let's go underground. Jamaica's riddled with caves, just waiting to be explored. These natural wonders are a testament to the island's rich geological history. The Green Grotto Caves, a labyrinth of underground chambers formed over millions of years. Each twist and turn reveals a new marvel. Stalactites hang from the ceiling like chandeliers, creating an eerie yet beautiful atmosphere. Stalagmites rise from the floor like ancient sculptures, each one telling a story of time and nature. Follow your guide through the darkness, listening to stories of pirates and smugglers who once used these caves as hideouts. Imagine the secrets these walls could tell. It's like stepping back in time, walking through history itself. And then there's the cliff diving. For those who crave an adrenaline rush, this is the ultimate test. Rick's Cafe in Negril, a legendary spot where locals and tourists alike come to test their courage. The atmosphere is electric, filled with anticipation. Climb to the top of the cliffs and take the plunge. Feel the wind rush past you as you free fall. The water's a long way down, but the rush is worth it. It's an experience you'll never forget. Just make sure you know how to swim. Safety first, but don't let fear hold you back from this incredible adventure. Section 5, Island Hopping. Jamaica's an island, sure, but it's not the only one in the neighborhood. Take a day trip and explore some of the smaller islands nearby. The Pelican Bar, a ramshackle wooden structure built on a sandbar in the middle of the ocean. It's the kind of place you only dream about. Grab a cold red stripe and soak up the vibes. Swim, sunbathe, chat with the locals. It's the ultimate escape from reality. Or head to Lime K, a tiny island just off the coast of Negril. It's a popular spot for snorkeling and diving. The water's crystal clear. The marine life is abundant. It's like swimming in an aquarium. Jamaica's got it all, man. From adrenaline pumping adventures to laid back island vibes. Section one, island appetite. Forget fancy restaurants and Michelin stars. In Jamaica, the best food is found on the streets in tiny shacks with corrugated iron roofs, where the air is thick with smoke and the smell of spices. This is food that nourishes your soul, man. Food that tells a story, 
food that's been passed down through generations, you'll find it everywhere, from roadside stalls to bustling markets. Just follow your nose and listen for the sizzle of meat on the grill. Forget your diet, forget your calorie counting. This is about experiencing the real flavors of Jamaica. It's about indulging your senses. It's about letting go and giving in to the deliciousness. Section two, jerk it out. Let's talk about jerk. Not the kind you went to high school with. I'm talking about the culinary masterpiece that is Jamaican jerk chicken. This ain't your average barbecue, man. It's a flavor explosion, a blend of spices that'll blow your mind. Scotch bonnet peppers, allspice, thyme, garlic, ginger. The list goes on and on. The meat is marinated for hours, sometimes even days. Then it's slow cooked over pimento wood, which gives it that smoky, irresistible flavor. You can get jerk chicken everywhere in Jamaica, from street vendors to fancy restaurants. But the best stuff, it's usually found in the most unassuming places. So ditch your guidebook, ask a local where to find the best jerk in town. Trust me, your taste buds will thank you. Jamaican cuisine is a melting pot of flavors, a vibrant tapestry woven from the island's diverse cultural influences just like the island itself, which is a beautiful blend of natural beauty and bustling life. You've got African influences, Indian influences, even a touch of Spanish and British all coming together to create something truly unique. It's a testament to the island's rich and complex history, a history that is reflected in every bite of its food. Take ackee and saltfish, for example, Jamaica's national dish, a true representation of the island's culinary heritage. It's a unique combination of savory and sweet, a delightful mix that surprises and satisfies the palate. Aki, the fruit of the aki tree, is cooked with salted codfish, onions, tomatoes, and spices, creating a dish that's both hearty and flavorful. It's traditionally served for breakfast, but you can find it on menus all day long, enjoyed by locals and tourists alike. Or how about a steaming bowl of red pea soup, another beloved dish that showcases the island's culinary prowess. A hearty and flavorful stew made with red kidney beans, coconut milk, and spices simmered to perfection. It's the kind of food that warms you from the inside out, perfect for any time of the year. And don't even get me started on the patties. These are a staple of Jamaican street food. Flaky pastry filled with spicy ground beef, chicken, or vegetables offering a burst of flavor with every bite. They're the perfect on-the-go snack, a quick and delicious way to experience the taste of Jamaica. No trip to Jamaica is complete without sampling the local beverages. The island's vibrant culture is reflected in its drinks, offering a taste of the tropics in every sip. And no, I'm not just talking about the rum. Though the rum is a big part of the experience, there's so much more to explore. Although, yeah, the rum is pretty damn good. It's a staple that you simply can't miss. Let's start with the non-alcoholic stuff. These drinks are just as exciting and offer a refreshing break from the heat. Jamaican fruit juices are legendary. They capture the essence of the island's abundant and diverse fruit offerings, freshly squeezed and bursting with flavor. Mango, pineapple, papaya, soursop. Each juice is a burst of tropical goodness. You name it, they've got it. These juices are a must try for any visitor. And then there's the coconut water. It's not just a drink, it's an experience. Straight from the coconut, it's the perfect way to cool down on a hot day. But let's be real, there's more to the story. You're not coming to Jamaica for the fruit juice alone. The allure of the island's rum is undeniable. You're here for the rum, and for good reason. It's a drink that carries the spirit of Jamaica in every drop. Jamaican rum is world-renowned for its smooth, rich flavor. It's a taste that lingers and leaves you wanting more. Try a classic rum punch. It's a delightful mix that perfectly balances the rum's strength with fruity sweetness. Or sip on a dirty banana. This creamy tropical cocktail is a favorite among locals and tourists alike. Just be careful, those cocktails can be dangerously delicious. They go down easy and pack a punch. And don't forget the Blue Mountain Coffee, it's another gem in Jamaica's beverage crown. Grown in the Blue Mountains, it's some of the best coffee in the world. The unique climate and soil give it a distinctive flavor. Strong, aromatic, and the perfect way to start your day or end your night. No judgment here. Whether you're a coffee lover or a rum enthusiast, Jamaica has something special for you. Listen, 
Jamaica isn't for everyone. If you're looking for sanitized, predictable, all-inclusive boredom, go somewhere else. This island will chew you up and spit you out if you let it. But if you're looking for an experience, a real, raw, unforgettable journey, then book your ticket, pack your bags, and get ready. This is a place that stays with you long after you leave. The music, the food, the people, the vibe, it gets under your skin. You'll find yourself craving the taste of jerk chicken, tapping your foot to the rhythm of reggae, smiling at strangers on the street. Jamaica is a state of mind, man. It's about embracing life with all its imperfections. It's about finding joy in the everyday. It's about connecting with something bigger than yourself. So come on, what are you waiting for? The island is calling. Get off the beaten path. Explore the hidden gems. Talk to the locals. Eat the food. Dance the night away. Come find out what Jamaica's all about. You might just surprise yourself. You might even find a piece of yourself you didn't know was missing. One love.